course, Foxy's going to be there. Yeah. Um, I mean, I think everyone in the UK is going to be in attendance because I'd of like that intercontinental so. spot. Yes. Yeah, if you win that tournament, you're going to DreamHack. And if you win DreamHack, then you're going to the finals. But plenty of music, plenty of time, sorry, since then. Obviously, we know this is actually is uh, not Sodium Jim and Droptimus. It is uh, Mr. Viper on Cabal, which I expect... Uh, Gears play here is Sodium Jim, I expect. Okay, there's the, the uh, grab. I've seen that, that. I must have seen that grab hundreds of times. I'm still not bored of it. It's sick. Now he's going to get the knockdown. Already showing Mr. Viper that he's not afraid to commit to that mix-up either. There's a whiff, but no punish. And now here comes the forward two. Ooh, and that's a punish. There's a crushing blow. Yes. I like how he tactically used it standalone because he knew he'd get the crushing blow as well. No crushing blow there because it wasn't a counter hit, but it's still going to be free damage all the same. And a uh, lot of work to do here as Mr. Viper. Uh, all right. Knocked down. Let's see. Cabal does have a lot of damage, especially oh, the if bait. you punish that. Could have been much bigger, though. You know, if, if you are going to block and... Uh, oh, that could have been a kill as well. People to confirm. And there it is, the Anya, Mr. Viper. Unfortunately, he did have the comeback on the cards, but wasn't able to make it. He's put in a lot of work for that comeback, and I feel he kind of just autopiloted a little bit with the jumping. Maybe. Um, uh, I suppose, uh, we should have to be careful, especially against the Gyrus that has that vacuum, that big distance, especially an easy anti air. But the big thing there was if you if you do manage to bait and block Gyrus' up two, because he's used resources to do it, you have to go for your max punish, as far as I'm concerned, right? Because he's going to be losing that defensive bar. You need to take your ability to get as much damage as possible. Gets that high up down two, so he gets the uh, down one juggle as well. One of the things about MK11, acknowledging that your your down two anti air sometimes connects from so high up in the air that you get guaranteed uh, quite often. Juggle. Actually, I feel like more so than in any other no game. Wow, that was a late body splash. Jesus. Oh, oh my God. No. He's the disrespect. Bar. I mean, I, I I respect the challenge. Honestly, look at the rewards that have come from it. Sodium Jim now and uh oh, is that dead? It what? is indeed. Oh my word. Okay, that's game number one then. Sodium Jim gonna take it. And Mr. Viper, I think, normally just came down for I think a mishandling of the matchup. Like, just not taking the opportunities the way he should have taken them. And also Jim calling out these throws every time. I, I feel like every time Viper has attempted a grab in the set, it's just been uppercut swiftly. Oh no, tries to down one out the air, uh, Gyrus, and that's going to be pain town if I've ever seen it. We're not it. seeing Sodium Jim confirm into uh, the launcher, though, which is not, it's not normally something you see. Uh -oh. oh, but he's been fishing for these counter hits big time, and he will get out. With a huge damage there, and there's the meaty this time. All oh, drops the combo. But Viper's making these. Oh, the scoop. He, he's making these really hard callouts on the grab, and he's eating mids for it pretty much every time. That's going to be Sodium Jim on match point. Oh. I, uh, really, I think trying to anti air Gyrus' body splash, I mean, that's just. You, you may as well just give the win. If you, you, know. you anti air it, you have to anti air it from like max distance, and it has to be with something very active, and there it is. Lost the breakaway, so you went for another down two. I fear that Mr. Viper is just being far too predictable now. He's been very timid as well. Every single. I think he's actually eaten every sand trap so far. Oh, and there's the meaty, and there's the confirm. I think this he's time. dead. He should. Actually, maybe not. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, he has the other bar. Never mind, he is definitely two. dead. Oh! Ah, oh, the down one with punish. It could have been so much more. That, by the way, is the first cancel we've ever seen this whole set. Now, when we see the comeback, there's the low. Oh, he tried to wake up, but he messed it up. Oh, the down one to get in between. I feel like that was just Mr. Viper kind of just mismanaging the matchup quite severely. And like I said, we didn't see a, a Nomad Dash cancel until the literal final round and the final moment.